بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين نويت التعلم والتعليم والتذكر والتذكير هو النفع والانتفاع والإفادة والاستفادة والحث على التمسك بكتاب الله وبسنة رسوله صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم والدعاء على الهدى والدلالة على الخير ابتغاء وجه الله ومرضاته وقربه وثوابه سبحانه وتعالى السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته الحمد لله we praise Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for having allowed us to enter the blessed month of Ramadan inshallah ta'ala Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala again through his mercy allows us to benefit from it inshallah ta'ala um, um, and continue to benefit from it even inshallah ta'ala if he allows us to depart from the month inshallah ta'ala bismillah <coughs> um, so we come back to the book now inshallah after um, having discussed in the last class um, how to put letters together at the start, base, basically start reading at a basic level, um, and also importantly how to stop. So if you were to stop at the end of any given word, that that you'd stop by making it into a sukun. Yeah. So we we did that last week. Any questions before we carry on? Hmm. Any questions? No. Assalamu alaikum. Could you please briefly refresh what we discussed last week? This is what we did. We discussed how to, towards the end of the class, we reached at this point where we're going to, where we're able to uh, read um, as such. Um, abadan, abadan, or if you were to stop there, Abada. Bismillah, have a go, Arthur, yourself. Uh, can I start? Just a second, please. Yeah, Arthur, go ahead. Yeah. Abada. Abada. <clears throat> Abada. Mm. Or if you stop there, you would say? Abada. Abada, good. Uh, 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 no, no, this is not a ja. There's no dot there. If you were to stop here, you take away the haraka. <clears throat> Sukun on the last okay. letter. Ahad, Ahad, Ahad. Yeah. Next word. Ajaz, Ajaz, Ajaz. No, it's not a gym. Gym has a dot below it. Ahad, Ahad, Ahad. Good. And if you were to stop there. Ahad. Ahad, good. Ahad, um, good. Uh, do this one, please. Rakam, Rakam, Ba. Rakaba fee. 
No, how is it a fan? What letter is it? Uh, is it a? Uh? Yeah, ta marbuta. So, rakaba. Yeah, rakabati. 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 Thin, thin. There's two there, isn't there? Two, two, two yeah, yeah, sorry. Rakabati. And if you were to stop there? Rakabat. Rakabah. The tamar bota, when you stop, you stop as a ha. Rakabah. Okay. Rakabah. Okay. Okay. Um, 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 read this. Sir, sir, look at the haraka. Look at the wall. What is the? It's not sir. That's a, isn't that a scene? Yeah, it's a scene, but, but what's on top of it? What's the vowel accompanying it? Patha, right? No, how is it a patha? It's a bomba. Okay, patha sorry. It's a plain yeah. line. Okay, so, uh, so, uh, <coughs> so, 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 Sururun, good. If you are to stop. Surur. Surur, okay, good. Surur. Yeah. yeah. Surur, okay. Um, yeah. That's what we did last week. Thank you. Anyone, any questions? Okay, so basically we started to be able to um, uh, read at a basic level, inshallah ta'ala. Um, let's do this next section, inshallah, and then go back to the mushaf, which is straightforward. So this is Al-Dars uh, al the seventh lesson. Al-Alif uh, al-Saghira, wal-Ya al-Saghira, wal-Waw al-Saghira. So the, sometimes, sometimes what you have, is you have letters like we mentioned um well we mentioned in passing okay I'll, I'll leave that for now but the point being it is possible that you might have an alif or a wow or a ya yeah written in such manner after the letter well if this is a hamza the uh, ha with the dhamma for the awal. Yeah, you treat them like normal letters. They are written as such. Why? Because, like we mentioned, um, there are two aspects to the revelation of the Quran. Yeah. One is the recitation, the other is the writing. Okay. So these letters, which are written as small letters, if you were to look at the Quran, which was um, recorded in the presence of the Prophet. Um, and that was compiled later by the Sahaba radiallahu anhum ajma'in, you will not find these small letters because they are not a part of the revealed writing, but they are a part of the revealed recitation. Okay, so in order to make it easier for the reciter to recite correctly, you have these markings in the Mus'haf. You have these markings in the Mus'haf, um, um, which have been introduced, um, which have been introduced, uh, uh, one can say innovated, um, which have been introduced into the Mus'haf in order to help the reciter recite correctly. Um, 
So this, um, so basically these small letters, when you recite, there is no difference. You know, there's no difference in recitation. It's just that in writing, the reason is because it's not a part of the revealed writing, it's a part of the revealed recitation. So other than that, there is no other difference. Yeah, when you come across, uh, and uh, and those of you who may have been exposed, um, as I as suspect many, if not most, are to the Indopak Musaf prior. So in that case, you might be a bit confused because you might think that this is the ba with an alif or a ya with an alif. Yeah, that is not at all the case. Yeah, it's not a ba with an alif or a ya with an alif. We have, I think we have explained this prior. A letter can only take a vowel. A letter can take a fatal of the maracas. It cannot take another letter. Okay. So the way it's written in the Uthmani Musaf is, is correct and much better representation of how it ought to be. A much more accurate representation. So we'll go through these one by one. So basically, all you need to do is ba, fa, alif, ba, so forth. Bismillah, who likes to, who would like to start? Uh, Assalamu alaikum, can I start? Oh, I can salam, please go ahead. Okay, so the, the alif, extra alif, which I don't need to read yet. You have to, you say ba, alif, ba, fatha, alif, ba. Okay. Ba fatha alif ba ya fatha alif ya ra fatha alif ya ma fatha ra ra okay ra ra fatha alif ra ma fatha alif ma la mim fatha mim mim sorry 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 mim fatha alif ma lam fatha alif la Wow, fatha alif wa noon fatha alif na. Good. Next, who wants to go next? Bismillah. Shall I? Yes, go ahead. Hamza fatha alif ha. Hamza Fatha Alif. Ah, no, 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 no. Again, Hamza. Ah, Hamza Fatha Alif. Ah, Ha Fatha Alif. Ha. Ain Fatha Alif. Ah. Go ahead. Ha fatha alif ha. Rain fatha alif ra. Ha fatha alif ha. Ta fatha alif ta. Ta. Okay, good. Next, Bismillah, who wants to go? Bismillah. Yes, Farah, go ahead. Salam alaikum. Tha, Fatha Alif, Tha, Jeen, Fatha Alif, Ja, Dal, Fatha Alif, Da, Za, Zal, Fatha Alif, Za, Za, Fatha Alif, Za, Sin, Fatha Alif, Sa, Sheen, Fatha Alif, Sha. Good. Next. Who wants to go? <coughs> Bismillah. Shall I? Yes, please. Saad Fata Alif Sa. Saad Fata Alif Do. No, first one. First one, please. Saad Fata Alif Sa. Ah, this is Saw. 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 Not, not like a scene. Sa. Saw. Saad Fatha Alif Saw. Saad 
Bismillah. Next last line. Who wants to go? Last line. Mahfouz, Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, Hamza Kasraya E. Hmm. Ha Kasraya He. Wa Dama Wa Wu. Hadama wa hu. Wow. Oh, yeah, sorry. The letter is wow. Sorry, yeah. sorry. Wow. Uh, yeah. Woo. Woo. Uh, Hamza. Dama. Wow. Who? 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 Yes. Who? I'm doing the Hamza. Yeah, last one. Last one, Hamza. Uh, Hamza Dama Wow. Ooh. Good. Good. Any questions, anyone? Yeah, could you please uh, repeat and explain the last row, which uh, which was just read? It's the same as the is the same as the first one, uh, the the other scenarios, but with a yeah or a wow. The all the other scenarios were with an alif, isn't it? And the alif need, uh, the alif needs a fatha before it. Likewise, the ya needs a kasra before it. E and the wow needs a dhamma before it. U. So this last row, hamza kasra ya e ha kasra ya he wow dhamma wow wu. Ha, Domma, wow, who Hamza, Domma, wow, who okay, okay. <clears throat> I was just wondering, I remember you saying uh, a letter cannot take another letter, yes. So this has uh, two letters on top of each other, right. No, no, it's not. It, it's it, the letter carries the vowel. The small letter which is indicated comes after it. Okay. Okay. So whenever you come across these markings for small letters, they are by themselves. They are by themselves. They come after the letter which they are written next to. So okay. a, in any of these examples, in any of these examples, what the letter, the, the proper letter carries is the, 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 the fatha in all of these cases. In all of these cases, the letters carry the fatha. In the other instances here, they carry the kasra and the, the rest, they carry the dhamma. So the letters, they only carry the vowel. The, the elongation letters, the alif madar, the vowel madar, the yamad, they come after the letter. Okay. okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Anything else? Anything else? <clears throat> okay. Uh, this is all just um, reading practice now. Yeah, Bismillah, we'll do it, inshallah. And then we go to the sukkah.
Okay, good. Bismillah. There's some practice in Allah Ta'ala today. Yeah. So, Dars al Thamil, the eighth lesson, Huruf al Maddi wal Lean. Yeah, Huruf al Mad wal Lean. Have you mentioned the term Mad and the term Lean? Have you mentioned it? I know it, but you haven't mentioned. Okay. Um, so the term mad, mad, in the language, in the Arabic language, quite literally means to stretch out or to spread something out. Mad dayamuddu is to stretch something out, to spread something out. Yeah. This is quite literally what is known as the mad in literally in the Arabic language. As it relates to the science of recitation, um, in the nomenclature of the science of the Jewish, mad means the elongation of the vowel sound, the elongation of the vowel sound. So if the fatha on a letter is followed by a alif mad after it, so this fatha gets elongated. So the a becomes a. If the Tasra on a letter is followed by a yamad after it. So this kasra e becomes e elongated. Now, if there is a wa, if there is a letter with a dhamma followed by a wamad, this dhamma gets elongated. So it goes from u to u. So, so what ha what's happening in all of these situations? These letters of elongation these letters of elongation, letters of mad. And they can only be these three, the alif mad or the wow mad or the ya mad. Yeah? They, what do they do? They elongate the sound of the respective vowel on the letter before. That's all, all the letters of mad can do. Okay? So the alif makes the fatha on the letter before it into a mad, into an elongation. The ya mad makes the kasra on the letter before it into a yamad, elongates it out, stretches it out, and likewise the wawmad. <clears throat> so in so the a becomes a the e becomes e and the u becomes u. So this is what the mad does. Yeah the plural for mad is mudud. Yeah <laughs> the plural format is mudud. And then you have the lean, the lean. The, there are two lean sounds in Arabic. So the lean is what happens when you begin on the sound of a fatha and you end on the sound of a wow or a ya. So the ai or the au sounds. These are known as the lean sound. Lean quite literally means to be soft, to make soft. Yeah, to be soft. Yeah, layin means to be soft, gentle. Yeah, um, there is a reason for that, but it's a, bit a, it's a bit of a technical reason. Better leave it for now. Why do we call lean as a lean? Um, um, so that, so be Basically, the word in and of itself means uh, gentleness, gentleness or um, lean. So these two sounds, ow and ai. You begin with the a and the, then you end with the u or the e sound. Yeah, this is known as lean. Yeah, these are the only two types of lean which are there in the Arabic language. Yeah, you begin with the a sound, ma. Aliki yaw, yaw middin. You begin with the fatha. So, for example, in fact, it's better to go to Surah Quraysh. So if you can see here, 
There's a fatha on the letter before the last ayah, the last word. There's a fatha on the letter before kha, and then a wow with the sukun. Khauf, khauf, kha. You begin the a, the in this case because it's a heavy letter a, as opposed to a normal a sound, and you end with a u. Khauf, khauf. Okay. So this is known as a wow lean, wow lean. And correspondingly, you have the other scenario where you have the letter before having a fatha, like the ba here, having a fatha. And after that is a ya with a sukun. Bait, al bait, ba, you begin with the fatha and end with the ya sound. So these two are known as lean. Yeah, either the wow lean or the ya lean. Yeah, the yuwaw lean is when you begin with a fatha on the previous letter and end with the, the wow with the sukun. Yeah, maliki yaw, yaw middin, ya, you begin with a fatha, ya, and then end with yaw, yaw, yaw middin, yeah, or as you can see here, had al bait ba ba and with e eat bait. Yeah, so these two sounds are known as the lean sounds. You begin with the sound of the fatha and you end with either the sound of the ya yeah or the wow mad. Okay, so these are known as the lean sounds. Yeah, there's the wow lean and the ya lean. Any questions? <clears throat> Any questions? So these are the, so that's a very quick introduction to elongations, elongations mudud and the lean um, sounds, which are the wow lean and the ya yeah lean, okay? So now we're going to go through these, inshallah ta'ala. Um, let's go through these. Um, yeah, uh, read them as you see them, inshallah ta'ala. Bismillah, let's start from the back. Tahrim, go ahead, please. Tahrim. Okay, Tabassum. Saif Khan, Bismillah. From the start, right? Yes, please. Bismillah. Ba. Bu, bi, ta, tu, ti. Don't say ta. Say, don't say ta. 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 Good. Tu, ti, ta, tu, ti, ha. Make the, make the, the, the tha sound clear. Tha. Tu ti ta tu ti ha hu he Okay, this is a clear. That's good. Muhammad, carry on, please. Muhammad. Muhammad, okay, Miss Bah. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, Muhammad, go no, okay. okay. Uh, sorry, my, my thing is a bit laggy. Where are we, sorry? Yeah, yeah. Khi. Oh. 
را رو ری ل زو ز مگد زکل ز ز زو زی Again, the za zu z needs to be stronger. Like in English, say, say zigzag. Zigzag. Ah, very good. Those the za that was good. Good, strong. Same. Za zu z. Za zu z. Z. Say za. Za. Good. Zu. Hmm. Z. Okay. Good. Uh, o, o, t, d. Mhm. Sorry, give me one second. The. Hung <clears throat> between it. Wa, wa, zu, zi, zi. We good. Pa. Okay, that's enough. Just a clarification. Miss Bah, carry on, please. Clarification. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Fa, fu, pi, ha, hu, hi, ya, yu, yi, a, u, i. Ja, ju, ji. Okay, just like no, I don't. Mahwish. Um, da, du, di, za, du, di, sa, du, si, sha. Shu Shi Su Si Su Si Do Si Do 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 O, U, E. No, this is not a Hamza. A, A, U, E. A, U, E. Okay, Zakla Fara. Mahful, Bismillah. O, U, O, 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 Ku, ki, la, lu, li, ma, mu. Karyan? Okay, Zach, my friend. And Hussain, what's the Karyan, please? ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがとうございました。ご視聴ありがと
Um, so, say, mm. go, say, and go. Good. Jazakallah khairan. Hussain, please carry on. Say, roll, ray, zo, zay, so, say. Yes. Continue. Yeah. Show, shay, so, say, do, doi, do. Jazakallah khairan. Uh, Amin, please. Thai, 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 Bay, do, day, ho. Okay. Yes, Arthur, carry on. Yeah, I have a question. Like, uh, uh, I'm not sure if I missed this. Or why are we making the how high sounds in this? Because it's a lean sound. Ow, maliki, yow, middin. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Where? where uh, yeah, these, because, are, these, uh, are, these are some other types of sounds. Yes. Go if ahead. you can just scroll up a little bit. Yeah, just when the blue letter started, we started. Uh, uh, yes, the, we're making. Uh, yeah, the coloring is to. Yeah, because these are the lean. It's written here, isn't it? These are lean sounds. All of these are mud sounds. The ones in purple were mud sounds. Okay. Okay. This will this start start from here, please. Hi. Uh, how? Hi. Ow, I, row, I, fow, fai, cow, kai, cow, kai, mau, mai, wow, wai, how, hai, yo. Yay. Very good. Tazakallah. Anyone, any questions? Anyone, any questions? Uh, the, uh, sorry, the mud sounds are... Uh, could you please tell me how you can, how you differentiate between the mud and the lean? Mud, mud sounds only carry on. The, the vowel on the previous letter corresponds to the actual mud. So if it's an alif mud, alif mud, there is no exception. It, it must be preceded by a fatha. So it makes the fatha on the previous letter elongated. So if this were without the alif, it would be ba. But with the alif, it has become ba. All it has done is elongated the sound. The wow mud after a dhamma, it only elongates the sound of the dhamma. Without the wow, it would have been Boo. Now it's boo. Uh, well, I think the question was the difference between mud and lean. Okay, Jazakallah Khairan. Yeah, I'm, I'm coming to that. Yeah. So the ba, the ba, with, without a ya after it would have been here just with the kasra, b. With the, with the mud, it's elongated. B. So these, these elongations, these elongations, what do they do? They elongate the vowel sound, the corresponding vowel sound on the previous letter. So, a becomes a, 
U becomes U, E becomes E. That's what the letters of elongation do. And you will notice that the letters of elongation will not have any haraka on them. You will not see any sukun on them. Yeah. Okay. When you come to the letters of lean, first and foremost, you'll necessarily, without exception, see a sukun on them. And the letters of lean, they do not necessarily elongate the sound, but they rather, they change it now. So you begin with the fatha, and you end in with the sound of a wow, or you begin with a fatha, or you end with the sound of a yeah, depending upon whether it's a ya lean or a wow lean. So, for example, tau, tau, tai, tai. So you begin with a fatha, ta, and then you end with a wow, tau. You begin with a ta, and then you end with a e, tai. Got it. Yeah. 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 So this is the difference between a mud and a lean. A mud and a lean. Okay. <coughs> Any other questions? Any other questions? Any other questions? Okay. Bismillah. Let's carry on. Reading, inshallah. So, um, so this is Dars al Tasi' the ninth lesson. Tadribatun ala tanwini wa aharuf al maddi al thalatha wa harfay al So these are exercises to practice the tanween which you have done the fathatain, the dhammatain, the kasratain, and aharuf al maddi al thalatha, the three letters of elongation, the alif mad, the wa and the yamat, waharfayilin, and the two letters of lean, the waulin and the yalin. Okay. Bismillah. Now, now let's start from the front, inshallah ta'ala. Bismillah. Atir, you go ahead. Read these words, please. And while we are reading these words, we'll also practice how to stop on them. So read them as you would read if you're carrying on, and read them how you would if you were to stop. Yes. Amana. Good. Amana. If you were to start. Amana. Aman. Good. Very good. Awaya. No. No. Look at this. Look at this. We have said a letter cannot carry another letter. If you see a letter on top of another letter, it means it is that letter. Okay, it's a leaf then. Correct. Yeah, and if you were to stop? Ow. No, it will be the same be because the same. Uh, letters of mud. Yeah, the letters of mud are technically letters with sukun. Okay? okay, technically they're letters of sukun. So if you were to stop, there wouldn't, it wouldn't make any difference. It would still be ah uh, wa. Yeah. Aniyati. Repeat. Aniyati. Aniyatin. 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 Good. Aniyatin. If you were to stop. Aniyatin. And if you were to stop. No, 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 no. See, this is a timer, Buddha. It's not a normal time. If you were to stop, it would become what? Ha? Is it a ha? Good, good. So? Ania. Ania. Excellent. Carry on. Ania. Uh. 
There's the sukun on top of the yeah, so is this a lean? Good. So, how would you say it's? Ayini. Ay? No one has a fatha. Ayin, ayina. Ayina, good. And if you have to stop? Ayin. Ayin, good. Next. Uh, Bihi. Good, be he. Um, there's a young mother, be he. But if you had to stop, be be excellent, very good. Bismillah, I'm in X. Ja, 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 ja. Okay, Land. we haven't come across this before yet. The reason why is, can you see a squiggly line on top? You want me to read line the squiggly line? No, no, no. Can you see the squiggly line on top of the alif? Yes. Ah, that means this alif is going to be longer than usual. Longer than usual. Oh. Um, this can, um, the elongation can have this for one of two reasons, if it's followed by a Hamza or if it's followed by a Sukun. So if it's followed by a Hamza, as in this case, you do it twice that you do normally. So make it twice as long. Uh, so you say, um, But if it's followed by a Sukun, like a Sukun or like a Shadda which you haven't done, then you have to do it three times what you do normally, thrice as long. Um, so that's for, for now, if you know this, it's enough. Yeah, if, if you see a squiggly line on top, it's telling you, you have to do this longer than usual. Yeah, if it's followed by Hamza, then twice as long. Uh, or, and if it's followed by a sukun or a shadda, usually it's going to be a shadda, then it is three times. Yeah, you say they're going to be twice or three times. So here it's ja ja Good. And uh, even for stopping, it will be the same? Yes, yes. For now, we'll keep it the same. Yeah. Ja. ja sorry, again? Ja uh no when you G stop you that when you read the hamza with the sukun you just cut off the sound so you read it as ja ja okay uh, and next b ya no no how is it ya yeah. there's no sir uh, look look uh, so so firstly this letter is completely ignored isn't it yeah. Okay, so this letter is not there. Just ignore it. You've got a kasra on the jim, and then this is what? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, how, how is it ah? Uh? How is it ah? Uh? Hamza? No, but this is a yamad. It's not ah. Uh. Uh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a yamad preceded by kasra. This letter is completely ignored. Okay. So it will be G Ya. No, why? G E A. G A. Not A, ah, don't make it long. G E A. The Hamza at the end. G A. G A. 
Uh, does that make sense? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So if you were to stop, it will be the same. G. Yeah. Good. G. That's it. Okay. Carry on. Ju in. Ain. Ju ain. Oh, Ju ain double kasra. In. Correct. Yeah, that is. Do in. Okay. in and if you stop do e no you take away there's no kasra it's gone finished that everything is it's just a sukun now do 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 okay okay uh khaifin oh, look again khaufin Haufin. If you stop. Haufin. Hauf. Hauf. Okay. Hauf. Khairun. Khair. Mm. Mm. Dawudu. Mm. Dawud. Good. Dawud. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. We'll, we'll go. Come around, inshallah. Farah, yes, please go ahead. Zalika. Yes. Mm, and if you stop? Zalik. Okay. Radu. Okay. If you stop? Will it be the same? Radu. Correct. Good. It will be the same. Carry on. Okay. Sha. Mm, if you stop? Good. Maliki. Mm. Malik. Mm. Shayin. Mm. Shay. Shay, shay, okay, carry on. Shay, Tara. Mm, if you stopped, same, Tara. Good, good, it will be the same, Tara. Good. Uh, next, Hussain, Bismillah. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, go ahead. Sorry, I have some head pains in. Which left which left am I starting from? So you're starting on the fourth line. Yeah, this word. Fourth line. Okay. Oh, oh. Good. Oh, you're on. Just a minute. Tarao, if you were to stop, would it change? No. Good. Carry on. Oh, you're on. Okay, if you were to stop. Oh, you're on. Tayra, very good. Carry on. Adin. Mm -hmm. If you were to stop. Ad. Good. Allah. If you were to stop. Uh, see, I'm not. This, I am confused on this. Would you use the yeah? Uh, it's not a yeah. It's an alif. It's, it's an alif written in the shape of a yeah. That's why there's an alif on top of it. Yeah, it's called an alif maqsura. So yeah, you would, you would ala, stop. Ala? yeah, you'd read it the same. No, 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 okay, no. no. Okay, you read it the okay, same. Okay, okay. You only, you don't drop a letter. You only drop the haraka at the end. You drop the haraka at the end. You don't drop the letter. You make it into a sukun. Here it's already a sukun. Cool. All the letters of mother letters are sukun. Ala. Is, this different? Is this different to the Indo-Pakistani mushaf um, we normally read? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, yeah, this that is makes the sense. Correct, this is, yeah, this is the correct way to uh, do it. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, this one. Yeah. I non. I non. Good. If you had to stop. I Good. Yeah, in the end of Agmosa, what will happen is there'll be an alif on top of the lamb. G. Yes, sir. And this letter, will you'll be like, you'll be, you have to just like kind of uh, pretend it's not there. Yeah, yes, yes, yeah. Yeah, the lamb cannot take an alif. The lamb can only yeah. take a, this is more correct. Yeah, because I, I, in actual, in, is the alif, which is the alif written here, which is an alif maqsura. It's written in the shape of an alif maqsura here because so sometimes it becomes, it behaves like a ya. Yeah. For example, if you have to attach anything to it. So for example, um, uh, alayhi. Now it becomes a ya. Yeah. 
when you attach yeah. something to it. I got you. Yeah, I'll so that's why the alif, this alif is an alif maqsur. It's written in the shape of a yeah. Uh, so in the, yeah, in the case so of Indo way, Yeah? Sorry, continue. Yes, go ahead. You know, in the case of Indo Pak, this wouldn't be there unless it was being continued, right? Yeah, the Indo Pak. Don't worry about the Indo Pak. You should uh, you should just focus on uh, the the way we are learning now is facilitating you to read from the Uthmani Mushaf. There's lots of problems with the Indo Pak Mushaf okay, if you want to try to learn properly. Yeah. So uh, to save yourself a lot of headache and to save yourself a lot of effort, yeah, just straight go to the Uthmani Mushaf and start start learning how to read from the Uthmani Mushaf. You'll save yourself a lot of effort um, and okay. time. Okay. Yeah. Bismillah. No okay. Um, Bismillah. Ayn. If you were to stop. Ayn. Good. He he. Mm -hmm. Sorry. If you were to if you were to stop. He. He. Okay. Good. Uh, Jazakallah khairan, mahfoud. Qala, qal, 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 Lauh, good. Lauh. Zakala Khairan. Misbah. Laysa. 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 Malan. Mala. Naran. Nara. Ma in. Ma. Wailun. You cut off the sound when you come to the Hamza. Ma. Ma. Wailun. Wailun. Wail. Yawmin. Yawm. Okay. Jazakallah khairan. Muhammad. Bismillah. Ya Ruh. No. If you have to carry on. Say it again, sorry, you're breaking up there, sorry. If you were to carry on, how would you say it? Ya Rahu. Ya Rahu, okay. And if you were to stop now? Ya Rah. Ya Rah, good. Next. Hasidin. 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 Not Deen, don't make it long. Hasidin. Hasidin. Good. And if you were to stop? Hasid. 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 Okay. Carry on. Hafizun. Don't say ha. Ha. Hafizun. Hafizun. Okay. If you were to stop? Hafiz. Good. Tafiqin. Carry on. Tafiq. Daf. Look, read it as you would read it if you're carrying on. Say it again, sorry. It keeps calling. I do apologize. Re read it as you would if you were carrying on. Tafiqin. Good. Now, if you were to stop. Tafiq. Okay, next. Shahidan. Shahidin. Shahidin. Okay, if you have to stop. Shahid. Good. Abidun. Don't say ah. Ah. Abidun. Abidun. Good, if you have to stop. Abid. Abid, Jazakallah khairan. Saif Khan, Bismillah. 
عائلا 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 how long عائل no no how is it عائل no look there's there's a فتحة in there isn't it we have learned this before so if you want to stop how you do stop عائلة good عائلة عائلة okay and how how long are we making this alif can you remind us please three alif no Two? Twice. Yes, two. Twice. Why? Okay. Why? For what reason? The skewed mud. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's that's there to tell you you have to make it long. But that's not the reason. That's a sign. Yeah, but what is the reason? Anyone? I mentioned it. Uh, because there's a hamza elongate. after. Yes, because there's a hamza after. Yeah, because of the hamza after it, you have to elongate it to twice what you do normally. Jazakallah khairan. Okay, does that make sense, Saif Khan? Yeah. Okay, Jazakallah khairan. Carry on, please. Rasikin. Mm -hmm. And if it was, yeah? Rasik. Okay. Nasirin. Hmm? Nasir. Hmm? Walidin. Walid. A'uzu. A'uz. A'un. Okay. A'uz. A'kidu. A'kid. A'kidu. Akidu, akid. Not, don't take away the ya as well. Akid. Akid. Good, very good. Jazakallah khairan. Uh, Tabassum, next one, please. Tabassum. Okay, so, Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. Bismillah rahman rahim. Ya khafu. Ya khafu. Ya khafu. Ya khafu. No. Ya khafu. There's an alif there, not ya khafu. Ya khafu. Ya khafu. Mm. And if you have to stop? Yakov. Yakov, okay. Yada who? Yada. 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 Okay. You call who? You call. Okay. To Robin. To, to no, not not to Robin. To Robin. Uh, okay, that's fine. To Robin. To Robin. Mm. And to, if you want to care, stop. Yeah. To Robin. Good. Hishaban. Not hisha, hisa, sa. Hisa ben. Hmm. Hisa ba. Hmm. Subat, subatan. Hmm. Subata. Subata. Just like Allah Khair. Okay, now we go back to the beginning. Arthur, go again, please. Sorry, from where? From the third line.
Siraji. Mm-hmm. Again. Sirajin. Si Ra. Look, there's Alif there. Si Ra Jin. How is it Jin? Look. Sirajan. Sirajan. Si Ra Jin. Okay, if you were to stop. Sirajan. Siraj. No. With the fact that it is unique, will you read the alif now? Siraja. 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 Good. Saamun. Sa. Salamun. 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 Mm. Salam. Salam. Good. Salam. Shidadan. Good. Shidada. No, not da. It's this. It's an alif. She da da. Both will sound the same. Da. Good. Sharaban. 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 Hmm. Sharab. Sharaba. It's an alif. You have to read it like a proper alif. Sharaba. Sharaba. Hmm? Swawaban. Okay. Swawaban. Why swawa? Saw. Sawaban. Sawaban. Uh. Sawab. Sawaba. Again, read the alif properly. Sawaba. The same way you do wa, you say ba. No difference. Sawaba. Sawaba. Okay. okay. Got it. This. Tahami, Tahamin, the ta. Sorry, what? Ta? It's a ta, ta, ta. Tahabin, Tahamin. Ta. Ah, it's a rain. Ta. ta. Okay. Tahamin. Ta. Mm hmm. Tahamin. Good. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Jazakallah khairan. Ami, Bismillah. Azabun, Azab, Ata'an. 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 No, in this case, you don't do that. Um, This is an exception. Okay, um, as you can see here, there is a fathatain, correct? There's a fathatain on the Hamza. But there's no alif written after it. Usually there's an alif written after, isn't it? After the fathatain. Except for a tamar buta, which we know. There's usually an alif written after it. So in some words such as these, the alif is not written. Why? Because according to the rules of the writing of the language, the Hamza does not accept an alif before it and an alif after it. So the Hamza, if it make it helps you remember, the Hamza is claustrophobic. It's claustrophobic. It cannot take an alif behind front of it, an alif behind it. It cannot accept it. So the so this alif is not written after it, but it has to be recited nonetheless. So if you were to stop, you would read it. Ato uh, 
good yeah so so in some words such as these where well, you will have a scenario um, where the salif is not written if the hamza has an alif before it if the hamza doesn't have an alif before it there's no problem you'll see the alif after it written but if the hamza has the alif before it has an alif before it it won't not allow for the alif after it to be written. In the case of the fathatain, okay? Bismillah, carry on. Not sa. Ghutha. Tha. Ghutha. 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 Good, very good. Carry on, please. Kitaban Kitaba okay. Kiraman Kirama mm. Libasan Libasa Jazakillah Khan. Very good. Farah, Bismillah. Hey, can I do it later? I'm driving, sorry. <laughs> okay. What's name? What's name? Sorry, half a stop. Where am I continuing from? So please leave from here. No. Apologies, I'm please just leave. working at the same time. Okay. Yeah. Lisa, none. If you were to stop. Sorry? So do the way you read it, like you just did, if you're carrying on, and if you were to stop, how would you say it? Oh, listen. No. No. Oh, you sorry, sorry, sorry. Lisa. Lisa. Sorry. Am I still here? It's, it's me out. Yes. One second. Yes, go. yes, yes, you're here. Lisa. Lisa. Is that better? Again, please. Lisa. No, when you do the alif at the end, make it clear. Like the same way you do sa, do na as well. It's exactly the same. Oh, yeah. Lisa. Yeah. Lisa. Na. Lisa na. Okay. Ma'aban. Okay, if you were to stop. Ma'aba. Ah. Mm. Yes, go ahead. What's in between the ain? Or is that just oh sorry, I get it. Mata'an. Good. You want to continue or yeah, every time you do the word, do what okay, you would yeah. do, how you'd stop there as well. Okay. Okay. Mutain. 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 Good. Mutain. Ma'asha. Mm hmm. Ma'fazan. Ma'faza. Good. Uh, Mahfuz, Jazakallah Khairan. Yes, Mahfuz, please carry on. Mihadan. Mihada. Mm hmm. Nabatan. Nabata. Wifaqan. وفاق فبورا فبورا رسول رسول شهود دون شهود اوكي جود يا جزاك الله خير مصباح بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قعود قعود وجوه وجوه أثيم أثيم 
عليم أليم بصير بصيرة خبير خبيرة مالكو جزاك الله خير محمد بسم الله رحيق رحيق شهيد شهيد عظيم عظيم قريبا قريب قريبا كريما كريم كريم كريما كريم مجيد مجيد جزاك الله خيرا ثاو يا موت موهيت 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 نائم Just a second, just a second. There's no, there's no muhita. No, muhita. Muhita. Darta. What? That's a fatha. Muhita. No. Muhita. Muhita. Okay. Ah. Na amin. No. Repeat. Na imin. Naim Yatiman Yatim No Yashiran No, 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 repeat. It is not Yatim if you stop. Ah. Yashir. Sorry, the previous one was not right. Yatiman, if Yatiman, if you stop, how would you read it? Yatima. Yatima. Okay. Yatima. Yashiran. Not she. Yes, It's a seen. Yasiran. Yasiro. Okay. Ruwaidan Ruwaita Again, Ruwai Ruwaita Yeah Kuraishin hmm? Kuraisha Kuraish ah, ku... Not uh, Fatha Kuraisha. Oh, no, how? Where? Okay, because. Repeat, how, how would we stop there? Kuraisha or Kurais. Which one is correct? Kurais. How will it be Kuraisha? There's nothing I mean, there. Because it's. There are two. two because it's. Uh, Kasla ten, and I think that will change to fatha. How will the kasla ten change to fatha? Why? Because, because I think that two line will change to one line. No, when you that's only for a fatha ten. Like ruway then, ruway then will become ruway da. Okay. Oration, it's kasra. Kasra just goes away. There, there's no sina. There's, it never happens in the Arabic language. Um, um, the, 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 other than that, you make it into a sukun. Oration will become Quraysh. So the second one, ta'im, not ta'ima, because... So, sorry, sorry? The second one. From... This one. Yeah, from right to left, yeah. Okay. And we should say ta'ima or ta'ima. No, 
No, no, no. It's not a time in the first place. It's a noon. Ah, na i min. So, so when we stop there, na i ma o na i m. Na i m. That's it. Okay. Ah, likewise here, kari min and you stop. Kari m. Likewise, this. Athimin will become Athim. Alimin will become Alim. Rasulin will become Rasul. So, Kasra, we will change to Sukun and uh, Fathaten and the Maten, we will change to one. Uh, I mean, only the Fathaten. Only the Fathaten. Only the Fathaten. Only the Fathaten. Majidun will become Majid. Okay. Shahidun will become Shahid. Muhitun yeah. will become Muhit. Qu'udun will become Qu'ud. Wujuhun will become Wujuh. Okay, I understand. Okay. Okay. Bismillah, going back to the top. Arthur, read the next line. Please. The last uh, row. Yes, please. And the two more. Just yes. the next, please. I sit in. I sit in. Okay. Why is it? Ah? Yeah, uh, it's an ayn and uh, followed by a uh, ya. Yeah. Okay, but what does the ayn have? So it's a kasra, so e e shatin. E shatin. E shatin. Okay, if you were to stop. E sha. Good. Yes, next word. It's a pretty long one, so I'm just building it up in my mind. Please give me a second. Um, al. 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 Huda. Two. Al Mau U Datu. Al Mau U Datu. Al Al Mau Tu U Datu. Al Mau Mau Datu. Al Mau U Datu. Al Mau U Datu. Can you say it here? Yeah? <laughs> Good. If you were to stop. Al Very good. Yeah. Is an Mau U Ida Mau Suilat. Mau Uda, the girl baby who was buried alive. Idal mau that to su ilat on the when she will ask on the day of judgment, bi ayi them bin kutilat for what crime was she killed? Female infanticide. Now, uh, Bismillah. Um, uh, next word. Um, 
Maudawatun. Repeat. Maudaw. Maudawatun. Good. Maudu. Maudu'ah. Maudu'atun. Repeat. Maudu'atun. Make sure you do the elongations properly. Maudu'atun. Maudu'atun. Good. And if you were to stop? Maudu'ah. Very good. Um, next. Can I go? Okay, Farah, go ahead, please. Mawazinuhu. Mawazinuhu. Zda, maybe Zda, clear. Mawa. Mawa. Just read it how you would read it if you want to carry on. Mawa zinuhu. Good, and if you have to stop? Mawa zinuhu. Okay, next. Yo ma ithin. And if you have to stop? Yo ma ith. Good. Any questions? Any questions, anyone? Any questions? We have had a, alhamdulillah, fair bit of practice today. Um, any questions? No. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll read a page from the Mus'haf. I'll read a page from the Mus'haf. Um, the next page, inshallah ta'ala. And uh, see if you can keep up. Um, see if you can keep up. Um, I think we've done, yeah, we'll come to this page. And um, for this week, practice, try to read this page with whatever aids you need if you have to listen to someone recite along with you or whatever or someone to help you someone who knows how to read can help you you go through it together mashallah alhamdulillah it's good the prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam he said khairukum man ta'allam al-qur'ana wa the best of you are those who learn the quran and teach it to others yeah and khalas, that's the best of deeds you can do in the best of times in this time, which is Ramadan, the month of the Quran, inshallah ta'ala. Yes, so, Mahfud, yes? Yeah, you, you just brought that up, Sheikh. I tried to um, send a message to admin last time to create a WhatsApp group, uh, but uh, I've received no response because it's only admins ah. allowed. On the group. Uh, I, what I would say is, you do it by yourself, Halas. You just approach people in the group who are interested, and you do, you do, you just set it up amongst yourselves. I've got no numbers though. That's the problem. I've got no numbers. You just message in the message in the group, inshallah. I can't get into yeah. the group. You can't. It's only admin. Okay. Um. So if sorry, uh, you have messaged the admin, have you? I messaged him two week, nearly one week ago. I've had no response. Okay, I'll I'll, um, I'll 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 speak to the admin, inshallah ta'ala. And um, um, uh, if you can drop and drop a message again, that will be okay. good, inshallah ta'ala. Okay. Oh, okay, inshallah. Okay, jazakallah khairan. Uh, Bismillah. So I'll read this page. See if you can keep up. And like I mentioned, try to. So this is the fifth page, is it? Yeah, fifth page in the Mus'haf. Um, so try to keep up with it, inshallah ta'ala. And for this for this week, try to read this page as much as you can with whatever help you need. Yeah, either in the form of person or in the form of an app or whatever it is. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Wa bashiril ladhina amanu wa amilu salihati 
It's called an idram naqis, an incomplete merge. Um, so the that's how the noon behaves with when it's followed by ayah. If a noon second is followed by ayah, that's how it be, behaves. Um, um, you don't need to worry about it now. Ayyu. There is no, 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 you don't read ayyu salah, you say ayyu salah, ayyu salah, you don't need to worry about it now. For for now, if you're going to pick up on those things, just imitate the reciter. So that will um, uh, help you to build up a level of familiarity with regards to, okay, this is how you would typically read in this scenario. Um, no, um, and the technicality of it will come at a much later stage because we are not necessarily at the stage where we can discuss those issues um, in any le any um, level of detail. Um, so um, um, 
we leave that at, for now. Yeah, um, uh, don't don't worry about it. It's it's good that you picked up on it, which is good. Um, but um, yeah, don't worry about it now. So, for example, كثيرا ويهدي به كثيرا كثيرا و again, yeah, don't worry about all of these things for now. Anything else? Anything else? Khair, inshallah ta'ala. We'll finish here for now and carry on with Allah ta'ala next week, inshallah ta'ala. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah, nastaghfirullah, nas'aluka al-jannata wa na'udhu bika min al-naf. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah, nastaghfirullah, nas'aluka al-jannata wa na'udhu bika min al-naf. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah, nastaghfirullah, nas'aluka al-jannata wa na'udhu bika min al-naf. Allahumma inna ka'afun, tuhibbu l'afwa fa'afu anna. Allahumma inna ka'afun, tuhibbu l'afwa fa'afu anna. اللهم إنك عفو تحب العفو فعف عنا يا كريم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته جزاك الله خير شيخ